What's going on guys, this is Jonathan here with Techfest Lunch and then we're bringing you the unboxing and review to the new Beats by Dre iBeats. Now these are high performance in-ear headphones, they're geared to replace those headphones that come with your iPod and the whole message behind this is that you spend, you know, 200 bucks on your iPod and then you go and spend 20 bucks on a crappy pair of headphones and you're really not doing the music justice. So on the back it talks about the features, this actually works with the iPad, iPod, iPhone and actually some Blackberry devices. So not only will it work for the iPhone and the iDevices but it'll work with the Black so we'll go ahead and make a little incision here and get that plastic shrink wrap off of this. Now these come in at $99. You can actually pick these up at Target today and they should hit Best Buy very soon. So there's a little magnetic tab on the side of the box. Right when we open it, you see we're greeted by the actual iBeats. Now once we remove the little tab, we see all the little different ear tips that come to custom fit to your ear size. I'll go ahead and get to those in a minute. We'll go ahead and see what else comes in the box. Now you guys can see we get a nice little carrying case with the Beats by Dre logo stamped right on the front. On the back we get some Beats silhouettes and the Monster logo again. Beyond that we get the documentation which basically covers your warranty information and how to use the control talk which is one of the bigger features on these iBeats. Now taking a closer look at the accessories we get an extra clip. We get two triple layer airlocks or I'm going to give a quick shout out to Uncle Tone 99 He's the headphone review and master. He calls these the Christmas tree looking guys. We also get five total ear tips from Monster. One of them being already on the iBeats themselves. Switch to the Super HD close-up so you guys can see these feature a solid metal housing which is going to eliminate any unwanted vibrations and it's not going to mess up your listening experience. So aesthetically these things look fantastic. You guys can see we get the left, the right, and we get the eye beats on the headphones themselves. Now the next thing I want to talk about is control talk. So on the top you can use this to go volume up. In the middle you can use it to answer calls, go backwards, forward, play and pause. And on the bottom you can use it to go volume down. Now moving right along on these headphones, you guys can see we get a very cool adjustable slider. Now what this is going to do, it's going to allow you to get a tight fit. Uh, so if you're moving around, it's going to keep your headphones in place from falling out. Now moving right along to the bottom of these headphones, you guys can see of course by Monster we get a gold plated tip. Dirty. Uh, but in all seriousness, after listening to these for a couple hours, I guess I can assure you in any genre, hard rock, hip hop, R&B, acoustic, you get a very well balanced, well defined sound and it's definitely an upgrade from your stock iPod headphones. So you get a lot of bass, a lot of mids, a good balance of the highs and overall I definitely recommend picking these up. Again, they're 99 bucks. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Uh, I got something a little bit different to close this video out. If you guys can do me a favor and help out my buddy Brian, uh, he recently had a problem with YouTube. He was working very hard. He had about 20,000 subscribers and he ran into some bad luck, got his channel suspended. Most of my viewers probably know him. He's Electronic Reviews, so he has his new channel out. If you guys want to do me a favor, go check his channel out. If you guys like it, uh, help his new channel out, subscribe, and get his channel back up. So as always, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, feel free to do so. Don't forget to check out all the links in the description.